In this video, you'll see how to use AWS X-Ray Insights. With this feature, you can automatically identify anomalies and trace data to highlight service faults so you can take appropriate corrective actions. Let's start by heading to AWS X-Ray. For the purposes of this example, we are running an application in our AWS account that handles pet adoption requests. The X-Ray service map tracks the path of individual user requests through the AWS resources in our application. We have also created a few groups in the X-Ray console to help manage our service. A group is a collection of traces defined by a filter expression. We can filter the service map by group using the menu next to the search bar. Let's create a new group for all resources involved in checking pet adoption status. We'll enable both insights and notifications. For notifications to be generated, we must also create an Amazon Event Bridge rule that defines the conditions under which notifications are necessary. Let's do that now. We'll use a predefined event pattern that invokes a target action based on the matching properties of an insight. Let's quickly test the pattern against a sample event. The sample event matched the event pattern. We'll set the target to an SNS topic we've already created and then create the rule. Let's return to the AWS X-Ray service map. Let's zoom in a little bit. We can see at a glance which services are the most accessed or have the highest latency. Red, yellow, and green color coding indicates faults, errors, and successful calls, respectively. We can change the presentation to resize nodes according to health or traffic. We can choose to show data from a predefined or custom time period. We can also click any line or edge between two nodes to view aggregate information about requests and responses that have traveled that connection. The Edge Details pane shows response statistics between the source and destination, as well as the error rate and traffic magnitude. Clicking a node brings up its service details. We can see that an insight has been generated for this service. Let's look at it. X-Ray continuously analyzes trace data on your account to identify emergent issues in your applications. When an anomaly is detected, X-Ray creates an insight that records the incident and tracks its impact until it's resolved. Let's look at the Insights page. The table shows insights generated for a selected group over a defined time period. In this case, the table is showing all groups. Let's drill into an insight. At the top of the page, we get an overview of the incident that generated the insight. We can see the root cause service and anomalous service, as well as the impact as a percentage of client requests. The line graph shows the anomalous service's actual and predicted rate of error. The service map shows the root cause of the incident and the impacted path. Let's view the root cause details. We are now in X-Ray Analytics. We can quickly see the response time distribution for the service and affected requests. We can also view and filter time series activity. Below the graph, we can see user metrics, if applicable, and the HTTP status code returned from the requests, as well as the accessed resource URL. Further down, we can see the user agent and HTTP method of the affected requests. Finally, we can see the resource ID and resource type of the root cause resource, as well as the root cause error message, if one is returned. We can also view traces for each of the affected requests. The Details page provides a timeline of the trace that includes a focused service map and segment chart. We can scroll down to find the exact error or fault cause. In this case, almost all the latency can be attributed to a step function component. We can drill deeper for information that will help us to resolve the issue. 
we can see that the error is produced by a Lambda function timeout and that no error message was returned. Let's return to the Insights page we were looking at earlier. At the bottom of the Overview tab, we can see the overall impact of the incident in terms of the number of client requests that were affected over time. We can hover over any part of the impact chart to see the response type percentages returned for client requests. Finally, let's take a quick look at the Insights Inspect tab. Here we can investigate the progress of an active or closed event and learn more about its impact on our application and client requests so we can take any appropriate corrective actions. You've just seen how to use AWS X-Ray Insights to automatically identify anomalies in trace data. You can learn more about this topic in the description and links for this video. Thanks for watching. Now it's your turn to try.